A.T. still enlists. He goes to Fort Leavenworth and he enlists as an enlisted man. He's a private. There's a photo of him from the family album. Also, you can see that photo in Frontier Doctor, written by Charles Still, and later written again by his grandson, Charles Still Jr. So he joins up, uh, and he says, I'm in an F Company of the 9th Kansas Cavalry, volunteers. But when they get to Fort Leavenworth, they're assigned to the Cass County Home Guard. So it's like, okay, where did he serve? He served in Cass County, Missouri, in the Cass County Home Guard. They took this group of Kansas, several of these companies, out of the 9th Cavalry, and they assigned him over to a Union federalized unit called the Cass County Home Guard. And they were going over into Cass County and converting those towns back to Union. After General Price had won the battle at the Battle of Lexington, they chased him down to Springfield and on back into Arkansas, and then they came back to the Harrisonville area of Missouri, and they patrolled that area for about five months, so from September of 1861 to February of 1862. That's where A.T. Still was at. Later in 1864, he will serve as a major, and that's where you see him on this mule. And this is a sketch from his autobiography where he says osteopathy is in danger because these men are at the Battle of the Big Blue, and he's leading them into battle, and he's shot at. He has a a musket ball go through his, his jacket but does not hit him. That mule wind will end up on top of him, and it's on his lower half, which probably keeps him from getting shot, but creates a hernia because he's trying to get this mule off of him. He will later claim a hernia as one of his Civil War claims for pension. 